Again, it's a shiny red engine. He always wants to look his best and he also wants everybody to know that he's the most special engine on the Fat Controllers Railway. One morning, James was shunting trucks in the yard, when a sleek car rolled up alongside him. I'm Finn Missile, said the car, and I need your help. Ah, groaned James. I thought you were about to comment on my shiny red paint. There's no time to do that, said Finn urgently. We have to stop Professor C from taking over the world. Who's Professor C? asked James. I will explain on the way. Suddenly, a large jet landed in front of James. The jet's door opened, hitched a cable onto James and mealed him in. Finn McMissile followed and the jet took off into the sky. Jet landed in a desert, far away from Sodor. The hero came out of the jet, James on some traps, and Finn on the road. Now James, warned Finn, the desert has no signs of services whatsoever, so you might hallucinate. I don't hallucinate, muttered James. If you don't believe me, ask that mermaid on the unicycle. James, groaned Finn, that's a tumbleweed. Why would the mermaid be on the tumbleweed? Asked James merely. I think you're one who's hallucinating. But merely, he had been talking to a rock. <laughs> you're jeopardizing our mission, snapped Finn. If that's your way, I'm doing this mission myself. Okay then, don't make sure the fat controller's head, James said sternly. Grrr, growled Finn. Yeah, good to you too. Now if you excuse me, I'll be in this karaoke lounge with my new friend Andy. James ran straight into Andy. Ouch! spluttered James. Andy, it's a porcupine! Forget it, Finn. Finn said to himself and drove away. Meanwhile, Professor C was planning his evil plan. <laughs> With this giant sun ray, I will have enough power to take over the world. Suddenly, a missile shot out of nowhere. It must Finn missile. Not so quickly, see? Not so quickly yourself, Finn. And blasted a cactus with his laser himself, which crushed Finn. Finn couldn't move. <laughs> Meanwhile, James was singing the song to Andy. He can brag all day, how fast he goes, how good he looks, he is such a post. Help! called the voice. James stopped singing. Finn is in trouble, he cried. You know, Andy, the Dalmatian with the head of a fat controller. And James puffed away as fast as he could. Professor C was about to blast Finn with his death ray. Say goodbye, Finn Missile. Then, suddenly, they all heard a whistle. It was James. He crashed into the sun ray and Professor C. Thank you, James, groaned Finn. 
Don't mention it, doll. Make him with a fat control on his head. <sighs> okay. Forget what I said, muttered Finn. When Finn and James came back the next day, all of the ancients whistled and cheered for their ancient friend, James. Thank you very much, said James, and I want to thank Andy. Ouch! I've got to stop hugging him!